just as the internet has made the world a global village and connected us it has availed us in information than ever before it is easier for us to connect to different people across different parts of the world you know very well that everything has been made easy and so it is also easier for the scammers to perpetrate their fraudulent activity to any one of us okay so that's why today I have decided to come up with a video to tell you a little bit of what I know about scammers and to let you know be to stand warned or to be aware of the scammers okay so these guys have always found countless ways to get their hands on people's money you have to be careful you have to be fraud smart you have to be aware of all the tactics they use to take away money from you or to get your money i have filmed this video during the time i don't know how it will come out but in whatever way it comes out as long as you get the reliable information about what i want to share with you I welcome you to my youtube channel Tosha Jacinta exclusive and I thank you so much guys thank you for supporting me thank you for being here thank you for standing in each and every time I upload anything you guys are always doing it for me yeah I thank you so much and everyone that doesn't yet subscribe to my youtube channel Tosha Jacinta exclusive I call upon your support click on the subscription button and after doing that turn on the notification bell so that you can be able to receive each and every video that i upload in time okay so these scammers use can use any means to contact victims and when i talk about victims i mean the people beba bako sente zawe ndi muko gira kubantu abatu banga bako visa masimo ibisede ibisinga asoboro kukubida na kugamba chino na chiri ni efuro mtu na kulimba limba sobe ndi muko gira kaba bantu i want you to stand wand kwa bantu mleme kugwa mkati baka abwe so it may be telephones just i have just said in my local language it may be the emails it may be the internet it can be through any social media like facebook it can be whatsapp email twitter and any so they always make sure they put you in their fix they always make sure you trust them and so having had you hooked they'll go silent or they'll ask you for money so after having got the money from you you'll never hear from them again there are many scam types okay abantu batu ba mungeri eze nja ulo wali wengeri nyingi jeba scam ingamu neba tuba wachitegera so engeri za nja ule ranga wena kogera ngenda kubanyo nyora emu kwe emu don't mind about my background kwe iya okay Eh, tem fire in your background. So the first one can be antivirus scam. They may call you and they tell you that maybe your computer, maybe we are calling from never get any application. Okay, never gamble. And maybe your computer has a problem or it has a virus. You send us this and that code such that we can be able to fix it for you. And in doing that, you send them your email passwords. You can send them anything. Okay. They try to pretend that they are antivirus people from a certain organization or anything like that. And by they doing so, you end up sending them anything. They may even ask you for money to fix that virus. Maybe in your computer or anything like that so you be aware of that teba kukubira neba kulimba anti obe simio ina virus obe ina chizibu bo chiti sindi kasente tu jirongo ose tu kubie sima nitu vawano o inzo kubobo ina chika cha simu samsung apple any kind of phone iphone neba kugambe bintu webitio oba laptop yo neba kugamba anti ina obe zibu sindi kasente tu jifixinge haba mba manina kujamu maka obo ina yo maidi Never again, never gamba made in to over computer. I don't know, and say over laptop where the catch is a bunch of over to me to get to the toilet to the long or say, My dear, those are scammers. 
then the other one can be a charity scam they can call you maybe they tell you that maybe we are calling from world food program or we are calling from unicef or we are calling from any kind of organization that helps people they tell you here is our bank account please help in such and such a way there is serious need of help triambe this and that be warned tawali your charity organization nga eina number oba oba dinya lya muntu oba bank account nga si ya kitongo lenga ya muntu se chinomo atene oba beranga ba creating ze kitongo le abasaba obiyambi te babusaba bwe bacho nga na dalaba bitongo lenge ebi ebinene atene we biba bitono so echo mberenga na cho mchimanyiko they can call you in form of an emergency scam for instance i may talk about that, those that hook facebook accounts so by any email or whatsapp basobolo genda never hooking into account your mutu never fool i and never kugamba funye chizibu for instance nzeta shani no buzibu webuti ne webuti monyambi they send your people text messages never bagamba nchua ine chizibu Chokanga babera baliimba. Okay? So abanabom begin it is when someone calls you or they send you a text message, maybe on someone's Facebook account, you take note, be cautioned. Tomala gauga papa, don't rush, don't try to rush that someone is in need of help, it is an emergency and this and that. Most of the time, they hack into people's pages. They pretend to be those people. They start sending messages to their close relatives or in person. Okay? Kumbe bagala kufunam biba funam. Babi. Okay? Then the other one may be in form of employment. They may come in as employment scammers. For instance, they can. Oh, I don't know how they fit this. Do you know that they can even go ahead and know the names of your family members? They may call my sister when they, they know that I don't have a job. I don't know how they get to know about it. They may call my sister. They tell them, hello, this is, is this Tasha's sister? Her telephone number is off, but we have a job opportunity somewhere. This and that. Okay? So, baso bolo kwa gira ni mganda waneba mli mba limba weba chone wa kukama nchi wababa kufuni domo limu na ya masimu kote gali yuko bichi bambi ni mupapa and at the end of the day waneba kukamba msindika sente wazi tine wazi tine wazi tine wazi tine wazi tine wazi tine this is a big deal if you don't put in that and that amount of cash you're going to lose out the job opportunity be aware of scammers you be smart about this the other one may be an identity theft. They may come in just as the one that I talked about, the emergency scam. They may come into, they pretend to be someone and they get something from another person. This, I may not spend much time explaining it, but I hope you understand what it means. Someone may call you and pretend to be someone, to be that person that you know and they ask you for help or anything from them okay that is also another way it may be an immigration scam they may call you that maybe your passport has a problem we are calling from immigration offices your passport has a problem maybe you're involved in such and such habit anything like that they end up asking you for money and every time they talk about money Ask yourself, what is this? Remember, Tasha told us. Okay? Kastabo gena kubia sent yango manyababi. Okay? Sometimes they may they, they may come in as, they pretend to be legit buyers or sellers of anything. Okay? It may be an internet purchase scam. You know very well that these days many of the things, many people operate businesses online. But on the event, So you may be selling cars, anything like that, or clothes, or shoes, phones, and so on. So they can pretend to be buyers or sellers. But so what you can do is on the event, don't you have a good event? Wabate gira nchi olinabi otunda befu lava gula. Wabate gira nchi olinabi ya garo gula befu lava bitunda. 
so even that one is important always think about it be fraud smart then the other one can be lottery or one price scam have you ever been called by someone pretending to be from a television station or a radio station they tell you you have one big prizes you have won a car you have one oh i came across that they one day called me they told me you have one acre they asked me where are you i told them i'm very fine in barara barara is there in uganda in western part of uganda so i try i pretended that i'm deep in the village so they said where are you you send fifty thousand shillings they, i abused them they also turn back and you know when you turn against them and you show them that you have known they as scammers they get annoyed but a lot of us with a baby around you may be a chat room never test and never gamba cut you go you get about to go you get about sometimes you could be a baby and move a full all in a full a man and you're in a full atelier connecting a bit of it never gamba you get a corner boss to a fee you get Never gamba you get a kwa ne bossu wa fe wono kwe gamba bali babi. They may they may come into money flipping scam. They tell you 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 can invest in that or that um in this or that amount of money no fnam waste. Okay, we can even call it fishing. They pretend to be a bank or a mortgage company, nebeful and Baba Kubanja, and they ask you for personal information. Okay, and when they ask you for personal information, you're going to give it in. And when they get to know about your personal information, they may penetrate into anything of yours. Okay. Bajakuba, don't be asked for an email or no you don't be asked for any passwords no you okay and sometimes they may be sms or smishing scams they may send you an sms on your phone and they send links the moment you get links that you don't understand on your phone don't rush into accepting them or clicking onto them but for now link you could see me on the top of the messages to papa kuniga links is water money never over to my new so my blue off nature to get a blonde you could see me on touch papi that you need to go or in so when you got to come on you got scam and all clicking on my boat the information is spread out to the scammers okay then the other one may be in a relationship scam back on a facebook anywhere they pretend to be in love with you they try to talk to you they may even give themselves time they may take weeks they may take weeks in or even months at the end of the day they pretend that they have bought for you goodies they may say we have bought for you a smartphone and in this kind they may say they have bought for you an iphone maybe golden necklaces earrings they may tell you we have bought for you gucci i tell you know what girls want you know what girls want the way women love free things <laughs> that's how they they scam them so when they tell you they have bought for you things they tell you maybe they're importing them is it importing exporting importing i went to school so they may tell you that they are they are shipping that the goodies or the gifts never kugamba you you we are going to drop them at the airport maybe we are going to use the dhl but when the things reach or when your gifts reach at the airport maybe someone that has to pick them will have to give in such and such amount of money in order to receive the what the packages so the moment they tell you that just know it is a scam don't accept that okay block them do anything that you feel like but don't give in your money baku gamba to akukuli the same way same you know and most cases they even show you the pictures of such things they pretend to be at the airport and handing in your things for travel kombe bali imba okay so you be smart you be fraud smart 
tokirize byo kulimba mbo bakugulide simu ne bakulage bi box bya masimu obe simu yenyini baso bolo kulagenga tenno nji obe ngoye obane bakulaga oli asobala no kulage moto kanti yaji kugulide nti aji shipping na akulaga nti you know why aka sente kati ni bali abagendo bikutusako my dear the moment you send them the money or anything their funds will go off and if not so the funds will keep on but you'll have nothing to do with them ate bajja kulaga nti bakuvuma no kuvuma na yenga bakuvumira ku sentezo so you be smart you be fraud smart the other one will may be social networking and if they gain access to your personal or social media accounts of course they will get access to your relatives accounts or your friends accounts icho mchimanyi bulonje ate mumanyi oba maloko kubitegera byo babikoze so already ebye bimu bade mbi explaining zeko it may be a tax scam they come in and tell you that you have not paid your taxes those ones that operate businesses i may give an example of my home country uganda they may tell you that you have not paid your taxes and they tell you if you don't pay them in this and that period of time you are going to come and close the business they put you on tension to pay the money within that fixed time that they suggest so in doing that don't accept don't accept don't play with your money people don't play with your money we work hard for this money we struggle for the money make every penny count don't just give in your money like that you understand so i wasn't in no i didn't want to make a video today but i just thought about this thing banji baba pye banji baba pye mungeri ene ya scam tokiriza muntu kufera kugamba mbo ebintu simanyi na kusindikide ebintu mbo gena bifu nako ya protein buleta ya kasente bwe kati ne bwe kati abamu befula bajanja bi oba we bategera nti olina omurade ne bakukubira ne bagamba tuline dagala bwe liti ne bwe biti ogendo somulura mbike bebe bakwasiza nga muri mu mayinja or anything like that my people you be careful jamukiriza abantu kubabba Olita kulimba limba mbu na kugulide mbu ebintu we bitine bwe bitimbu simanyi kino ne kino simanyi na ngeri kigenyi za banyonyola mbino bintu naye mu bitegere abamu abaina ba maids waka they may come home ne bagamba maid nti obo batumye tv jirongosa nti oba baze kukanika masanyalaze bino byona byona bibaddewo ate bichaliwo babide mu abantu banji ate era bachaba na hebo boy nayo omuntu wongo mwagaliza obutabbiwa you may share this video with them share this video with anyone gwe mulabanga asobola okubbiwa ate late wali yogwe batabba it's all about having some information about something that you can be helped at the end of the day okay so i just wanted you to be fraud smart be fraud smart my people okay te bababa te bababa asobala no kujanga ze chima bana na kulimba anti bamutumya bana mukuma bana ba bantu banaye temulaga jala bano baskamaz sijana tsina na linya lyensobola bawa obatu bayite bano ni mas <laughs> mubegendereze bantu bange so that's what i had for you today i thank you for watching Thank you for supporting me mongere yobombe for bambi mwe bale nyo mwe bale reddala mbasaba video yange muji sharing na balala bitkwato ko in case you have anything that you wanna ask me yeah drop it in the comment box like my video share it comment and please kindly subscribe i love you all and stay blessed bye bye abakozi mukole nyo temutakali mu banaye no matter what you're going through you keep hustling and work with the purpose tomalaga sasanya sente zo mu bintu bitalimu tomalaga jaja miaka sente ko ochitegera tobera onola gajala no gamba nja kola nzeze wo rwencha kubanga tomanyi ncha chiche chija tomanyi byancha so as you spend today think about tomorrow 
and remember your family is your family your family is your number one priority and a close to few friends abata sobala na genda ku finger tips omanye mikwano tubane mikwano mingi na ye omutufu goba mugumu oba babiri okay so abantu abo boto alange ekikolo mu bulamu bo tobasulirira nyo think about them okay tewera bila job de tewera bila ba tewera bila background yo tewera bila nakuyo tewera bila biro bilirwabyo tewera bila bulambo obulambo ebugaga obulamu chintu chikolo so in each and everything that you do mind about yourself mind about your lives mind about your family kubanga bebata genda kule kulira na abana bo i love you all may god bless you for me let's stay connected okay subscribe and be with me next time bye bye